Hi all, in this video, I am going to show you how to use ICV VUE layer debugger utility to debug DRC rules and run set. Debugging a run set is a tedious cycle of analyzing output and manually writing out intermediate layers and isolating problems. The ICV VUE debugger simplifies this process. One run retains all of the intermediate layers without any manual run set editing. ICV VUE debugger output is simple. It displays all the intermediate layers created during the DRC run to narrow down the issues. To use the layer debugger, start ICV VUE and connect it to IC Workbench tool or invoke ICV VUE from IC Workbench tool if ICV VUE is already integrated in it. In ICV VUE tool, from the Execution Form tab, locate a run set in the Run Set File text box. In General Form tab, click Import Information from Layout to automatically extract layout information like library name, cell name, and format from the Active Layout window loaded in the IC Workbench tool. Under DP Distributed Processing tab, specify the number of CPUs to run ICV. Here is an example of the run set file where we see the rule name and comment along with the functional logic coded for this particular rule. Please note that the rule comment starts with at followed by the rule name in dot convention like m8.s.3 along with the comment. Also note that the rule name is written in underscore convention like m8 underscore s underscore 3. Under DRC tab, provide the rule comment you want to specifically debug using select violation by comment option. You can also debug a particular rule by providing rule name using select violation by name option. Here star indicates the wildcard pattern. Put ICV VUE in layer debugger mode. Choose file layer debugger. From the execution form tab, click execute to run ICV layer debugger. The layer debugger executes the run set with the given rule to debug. After the run completes, the debugger output is loaded in a new tab. The Layer Debugger tab shows each of the command executed during the debug run. When connected to IC Workbench, the Layer Debugger opens the output library. Violation output can be shown together with the Layer output in IC Workbench by selecting the checkbox next to Violation Producing command line. Click a layer to turn the layer on and click it again to turn the layer off. All of the layers are shown either in blue or cyan. Non-empty layers are shown in blue, whereas empty ones are shown in cyan. When you hover over a layer, the total number of written polygons are displayed. When you hover over the command name, the full run set name along with the line number are shown. When you click on a particular layer in Layer Debugger window, it is simultaneously highlighted in IC Workbench tool. You can customize different layers from Layout Layers palette for debugging purposes. The layer numbers and data types seen here in Layout Layers panel are generated by ICV Debugger. It's not same as the original layer numbers used in the run set file. In this way, you can navigate from function to various layers to debug the actual issue causing the violation. The layer debugger run also generates an output library under run underscore details forward slash layer underscore debug underscore info. This output library run set name underscore ld dot gds contains all the layers generated by the IC validator tool. So this is how you use ICV Layer Debugger from ICV VUE tool. Thank you.